Yeah. Got another point here. I don't know if you can see them there yet. I know there's birds have been in here. I've seen them flush. Oh boy. Good boy, Cap. Easy. Easy. Good boy. That's a good boy. Those, my friends, were Hungarian partridge. Good boy, Cap. The ruby's pointed. I'm pretty sure these are roosters or pheasant, some whatever. And I've been getting a lot of them out of this ditch. Let's see what we get. Good girl. Yeah. They're moving, whatever. Good girl, Ruby Doo. Good girl. Come on. Easy now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's see what kind we got here. Make a liar out of me. Let it be some sharp tails. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Look in there. Yeah. The way these things are moving, I think they're pheasant. Good girl. Good girl. Ruby do, do, be, Ruby. Ooh, I see the bird walking. <laughs> I see the bird walking. It's a rooster. Darn it. Staying just ahead of us. All right. Let's see what we have here. Good girl, Ruby. Whoa. This could be Huns. Uh, hen rooster. Come on, Ruby. Good girl. What a beautiful country, huh? <laughs> Even a bad day hunting. Better than the best day at work. Not bad for an 11 year old dog. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good oh boy, Mickey. Good boy, Mickey. See him on point, brown dog. Good boy, Mick. Good boy, Mick. Easy, buddy. Oh. Oh, boy. There they go. Good boy, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Hey. 
Here. Dead, dead, dead. Yeah, good boy. Good boy, okay. Easy. I just got one. He'll be okay. Well, it came out a little funky, a little wild. I think he was on point. I wonder. What? Did you hear me go, shoot that one? Then he did. <laughs> I said, shoot that one. Did, he, did Jake get the bird out of there? He pushed one out, yeah. All right. It, well, he was in the nose, he was nosing in and it came out this side. Okay. Good boy, Jake. Come on. This is the best thing for him, you know. Oh, yeah. Come on, Jake. Up oh, there goes one. Yeah. Yeah, dude, right on his tail. Did you see that bird go in there? No. Okay. Jack, 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 look in here, buddy. All right. There we go. Point. Whoop. Oh boy. That's a pheasant. Point. Oh boy. <laughs> Easy.
This is going to be a pheasant. Yep, there it goes. Leave it. Leave it. Come on, buddy. Leave it. Come on. Shaq, leave it. Come on. Come on, bud. Shaq, leave it. Ah. I should have set you for sharp tail. Shaq, here. Boy. How's that feeling? Pretty good? Good boy. Ugly. Oh, oh, oh. I could. Made it. <laughs> Where you been, buddy? <laughs> I've been hunting. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. He's capper. Cap. He's only Come here. About yeah, good boy. Good boy, Shaq. Piece of cake. A oh, beautiful bird for you, buddy. Beautiful bird. Nice find, too. Good work. Good work. Oh, man. I don't know if you can see him or not. Oh, shoot. It's straight uphill. Yeah. He's got to be Holmes. Good spot for him. What you got, buddy? Where are they? Where are they, Shaq? Right here? Where are they? You promise? Okay, okay. Crap. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come on, Shaq. Well, they were here. They're not now. I don't like to give up any altitude gain, so I'm going to go keep climbing. Come down the other side. I'll see what we can find. Ah, it's beautiful. I'd like to be the first guy through here on a horse. Oh my gosh. Well, I think this is a wrap. We're headed back to the truck. And uh, it's right at the top of the hill here. And I hope you enjoyed sharp tail hunting in Montana. This grizzled old guy. <laughs> Randy Schultz, a birdhunterthoughts.com. And you can check out my website slash blog. And of course, if you're looking watching this, you already found my YouTube channel, so a bird hunter thoughts. And you could check out my two books, Endless October, and the craftily named second edition MS October season two. All of it's on Amazon, Kindle, and audiobook narrated by yours truly. So we got some sharps, we got some huns. 
and uh, true to form, imagine that it's hot in Montana in the uh, first week of September. So I'm on my way to uh, Wyoming, hunt bluegrass up in the mountains. And uh, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Come on, buddy. We're almost home. And I'm met by another friend up there. And we'll uh, have some fun. I've never done that. It's supposed to be a good year for them. And they are at elevation. We're going to be operating at between seven and nine, 9,000 feet. So. And one of the good things is you can drive a lot of those tree tracks up there in a mule and Gary's got one it's six by six and we're gonna use that to get in the area. So don't forget my sponsors, Dr. Tim's at drtims.com dog food, high power for your dog at espamerica.com for ear attenuators. Don't be dumb like I was. Wear attenuators, don't go deaf in old age. Well, that's about all the wit I've got. I'm beat. Till later.